Hi folks and welcome to In The Kitchen with Pete. It's been a while since I've done a video, but what better of a place, my favorite place to cook here in Florida, in Boca Grande, down at the beach on the Gulf side of Florida. I'm gonna cook up some cod in a cast iron pan, and I'm gonna nestle it in to this beautiful sauce I've made that's balsamic and tomatoes and herbs. It's gonna be outstanding. Let's get to it. Now, how's that for a kitchen with a view? Just beautiful. I think I could cook here every day of the week. I prepared my seasoning for the fish at home, and it's simple. All it was was a quarter teaspoon of garlic powder, half teaspoon of Italian seasoning, a half a teaspoon of dill, and just a pinch of salt and pepper. I've got two lovely fillets of wild Pacific cod. Using paper towels, we'll make sure that they're dry before we go ahead and season them. I'm gonna generously season both sides. I'm using my portable butane stove it's great for taking to the beach. And I've heated up my cast iron pan and I'm gonna put a tablespoon of garlic butter in there. Once we've melted that, we'll add our fillets. I wanna press down on them just to ensure you get a good sear on them. And we'll cook those for three minutes. After three minutes, We'll flip the fillets, and we're gonna add a generous squeeze of fresh lemon juice. I've got about a quarter of a lemon, and just squeeze it over top of both fillets. We'll turn our heat down to around medium or slightly under, and continue to cook that for three minutes. Now when this is done, it would be a perfect meal just as it is with a little side salad or your favorite vegetable or maybe a little bit of rice. But what I'm doing today is a sauce. In my next episode of In the Kitchen with Pete, it will feature the complete making of this sauce. But it's a balsamic tomato and herb sauce. It's such a delicious and versatile sauce. It goes with chicken, pasta, and or fish. My fillets are done so I'll remove them and set them aside. And now it's time to get my sauce heated up. These small cast iron oval pans are perfect for a single serving fun for appetizers too. So I've got my balsamic tomato and herb sauce, but I'm adding a little bit of sliced black Kalamati olives. It'll just give it that Mediterranean flavors that I think go so nicely with this fish. It's all warmed up. We'll just nestle the filet on top and oh my, doesn't that look outstanding. Now it's time to try the goods. Oh. Tender, delicious. You're gonna love it. Until next time, see ya!